Maza is Spanish for dough. Although the word is mostly used to refer to any kind of dough, in some regions it is often short for maza de morzed, a maize dough made from freshly prepared hominy. It is used for making corn tortillas, tamales, pupuses, and many other Latin American dishes. The dried and powdered form is called maza harina, maza de harina, and sometimes mazcac, the name of a leading commercial brand. It is reconstituted with water before use. Maza is not to be confused with mazepa, maza de erpa, or maza al instanti, a type of unmixed malized, soaked, and cooked cornmeal used to make airy pass. Maza de triago is Spanish for wheat flour dough. It is also used for making wheat tortillas and other breads and pastries. To make hominy, field corn grain is dried and then treated by soaking and cooking the mature grain in a diluted solution of slaked lime or wood ash, a process termed nixtamalization. Lime and ash are highly alkaline, the alkalinity helps the dissolution of hemicellulose, the major glue-like component of the maize cell walls, and loosens the hulls from the kernels and softens the corn. Some of the corn oil is broken down into emulsifying agents, while bonding of the corn proteins to each other is also facilitated. The divalent calcium in lime acts as a cross-linking agent for protein and polysaccharide acidic side chains. As a result, while cornmeal made from untreated ground corn is unable by itself to form a dough on addition of water, the chemical changes in maza allow dough formation, which is essential to the ability to fashion dough into tortillas. Finally, in addition to providing a source of dietary calcium, the lime reacts with the corn so that the nutrient nicine can be absorbed by the digestive tract. While consumption of untreated corn is a risk factor in predisposition to pellagra, as in African countries, the risk is dramatically reduced or eliminated by nixtamalization. The soaked maize is washed, and then ground into maza. When fresh maza is dried and powdered, it becomes maza sacan or maza harina. The process of making hominy is also called nixtamalization and the ground product can be called maza nixtamalera. In Central American and Mexican cuisine, maza nixtamalera is cooked with water and milk to make a thick, gruel-like beverage called atol. When made with chocolate and sugar, it becomes atol de chocolate. Adding anise and piloncillo to this mix creates champurado, a popular breakfast drink. References